Welcome to another uh, exciting automation video. My name is Johnny Automation and today we're going to be talking about push buttons. <laughs> yep, there's a number of different push buttons out there today. We're going to try to focus on just the 22 millimeter push buttons. So here we have a bunch of different push buttons. The, this one happens to be an oldie but a goodie. It's an 800T push button. You see these uh, most often at amusement parks. They're rugged, they're bulky, and they're kind of expensive, and we're never gonna use these. So, another Allen Bradley, a simpler one, more up-to-date. Um, it's got a metal body. This is an Eaton Cutler Hammer one. Um, it's a momentary push button. It has a uh, blue lens, so it's a lighted one. There's another Eaton Cutler Hammer. This is an e-stop, push and then twist to pull out. Keyed switches, we got some uh, keyed switches. And that brings me to Omron, the push button of choice. So right here we have a momentary push button, red with a brushed metal bezel. Very, very nice, a single contact on the back. Assemble a 22 millimeter Omron push button. I have a two push button cover box here, and I have a two position actuator switch. I'm going to slip on it in a legend plate. This one happens to have slow and fast, which should work good. Put it through the hole. Now we have to put the anti rotational tab on, which slips on the back of the push button. There we go. Then we put the the nut, the backing on the nut. You use an Omron push button tool. It's got little notches, slips on there, and tightens it up pretty good. A lot better than using a wrench, especially with these big sausage fingers that I have. Next, you put the body on. Again, you keep an eye on the, the top, slips on, push the little lever over the, to the side, locks on nice and good. Now this is a lighted selector switch, so you need a 24 volt, in this particular instance, it's a 24 volt module with a white LED. Slip the LED into the module, and then the module just snaps right in the middle. Then I got a normally open contact block that snaps on and a normally closed contact block. And you can add more contact blocks onto the top of this. So if you needed four contact blocks, depending on what you're doing. And there you go, an assembled push button. Thank you very much, bye. Oh, by the way, Omron, I need some swag. I want some t-shirts, maybe a towel. I need some swag.